Hey, don't miss this. A High Point pastor powering through coronavirus. Remember Pastor Rory Baker? He survived coronavirus after 87 days in the hospital. We first met him in April and we were there for his release from the hospital. WFMY News 2's Adoria Chumba learned his family has even more to be thankful for this week. As families take stock this holiday season, Pastor Rory Baker isn't just thankful that he survived COVID-19. Did a heart surgery was something to me, but it was all because of the COVID virus. Three weeks ago, Pastor COVID. Rory Baker had open heart surgery. The father of seven says it's just one of the many COVID-19 side effects that he has had since leaving the hospital in June. I became acute anemic. Uh, I had uh, gangrene in my toes. Subsequently, I had to have two of the tips of my toes amputated. And there's so many different things that are happening, and you never know until they start happening. Now 55, Baker says his voice and strength are slowly returning. We first met his meal. wife, Melissa, this summer as she prayed by the hospital entrance twice a day. She said she's still stunned by their experience. I know there are a lot of families that's not able to um, have that testimony, but truly I'm grateful for that and for everyone that has prayed for my family, for my husband's continuous healing. The Bakers say they and, pray um, for other families who have lost loved ones to COVID-19 and count their blessings, not just for Thanksgiving Day, but for every day. We have learned how to enjoy each moment together as a unit and as a family. And I tell people all the time, you love people like it's the last day that you're gonna see them and you won't have any regrets. In Guilford County, Aduria Chumba, WFMY News 2.